Hello and welcome to Quick Tips for Using Lola. This resource will provide you with tips on navigating your way around Lola. And in this video, I will walk you through the steps to logging into Lola to edit, delete, and add new personal contact information. And since the college sends communication to your preferred accounts, I'll also show you how to label which account will be your preferred. So starting at the DCC homepage, go to the Quick Links dropdown and select Lola Login. Type in your username and password and select sign in. And now that you're in your Lola account, locate the section called self-service banner and select personal information. Select personal information again. This is where you can view and update your personal information. On the left, you will see a snapshot of your student profile. Your name is displayed just as the college has it in the system, and right underneath is your student ID number. A quick side thought about your student ID. If you ever forget it or misplace it, this is a good place to quickly retrieve it. Additionally, on this screen, you will see your personal information listed, such as your email addresses, phone numbers, mailing addresses, and emergency contacts. You'll also see the editing icons nearby. To delete an account, select the delete icon next to the account you want deleted. Select delete again, and now it is removed. And just to clean things up a little bit, I will delete this Yahoo account as well. To add a new account, select add new. Choose the type of email account that's being added. So in this example, I'll choose personal email. Type in the email address and then select add at the bottom. And once we do that, this email address has been saved and added to the Lola account. If there are mistakes in the information listed, you can always go into each entry to make edits. To edit an email address, select the edit icon, then fix the mistake and select update. And then it's fixed and saved. To identify the preferred account, select the edit icon, click in the box to place a check mark, select update. Moving forward, email communication will be sent to the one that is labeled preferred. As you can see, the update feature is straightforward, so follow the same procedures and guidelines to update your phone numbers, mailing addresses, and your emergency contact information as well. One final thought. If you need to update personal identifiers, such as your name, date of birth, social security number, you will need to reach out to either the admissions or the registrar's office to get that accomplished. Well, I hope you found this summary helpful, but if you have additional questions, we are here to assist. You can contact Student Services by going to our DCC homepage and selecting the Need Help icon. From there, you can receive immediate assistance in the virtual office, schedule one-on-one -on -one appointments, or take advantage of our other online resources. You can also call or email us at the contact information displayed on your screen. And don't forget to follow Delgado on social media platforms. Well, that's all I have for you. We look forward to hearing from you so you can be in that number at Delgado Community College.